guys, so I have a collective clothing haul for you guys today, and some of the stuff I've had for quite a while, since the beginning of February, so I really want to go ahead and show you guys all this stuff. I've kind of been just shopping, picking up a couple of things here and there, and it's kind of gotten to be quite a few things, and also my brother's practicing his piano, and I'm pretty sure he's playing extra loud just to get on my nerves, so if you guys hear him playing piano, just admire his lovely piano skills. I wonder if you can hear them. So I don't really need clothes or anything, but every time I go to the mall or around shopping somewhere, I see such great deals. And when things are less than like $20 and they're originally super expensive, I mean, I feel like you kind of have to get them. So I, I mean, you really don't, but now I say that I feel kind of stupid, but I did get them. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys what I picked up. My friend and I were at Macy's looking at makeup, and then my mom came up super excited and was like, you guys, I just got three Michael Kors shirts for the price of one. So of course we all get excited, and we go and look at the sale stuff that is Michael Kors, and I found a shirt that I really like. This is hot pink sleeveless top, and this is just so gorgeous. Really bright colors are in this year for spring and summertime. And when I saw this, it looked like something that would just be coming out in a new line. But it wasn't. It was half off and then an extra 30% off. So I got a really great deal on it. It was originally almost $70, so really good deal. And it's just hot pink, like I said, and it has a little ruffle there in the front. So I think it's just going to be really cute. And I can probably get away with wearing it now with like a cardigan or a jacket or something over top of it. And then, of course, I can wear it still in the spring and summertime when it gets warmer. I also picked up this red sweater from Macy's. And where I live, it's just now starting to get cold. So I still have time to wear this. And I don't have a lot of red in my closet. So anytime I see something red that I like, I try to pick it up. And I don't have a lot of really warm sweaters either. And I love this because it is super super warm and I love the little pattern on it. I'm not really sure what kind of pattern that is, but it's just a regular knit sweater so you can probably use this for a lot of different things and really versatile and it also has a little button here so that you can clasp the front of it so I thought that was really cute too. And this one was originally $90 and I think I got it for less than $40 so that was a great deal on this. I have two things from Rare Turn 1 and this first thing I actually had in a recent fashion video and I got a lot of questions about where it was from. And this is from Forever Turn 1. It's just a black lace dress and I love this because it has a Peter Pan collar. I love anything with a Peter Pan collar and of course lace. Lace is probably one of my favorite fabrics. But it's just a really long nice dress. It kind of looks like something you would wear to a funeral but... Hopefully I won't have a funeral to go to anytime soon, so I've just been wearing it at church. And you can kind of dress it up in some fun tights and some wedges and make a really cute outfit out of it if you style it right. But I think I'm going to get a lot of use out of this dress too because it still is one of your basic pieces, but you can style it and accessorize it and make it fairly fun. I also got this white knit sweater from Forever 21, and I love this because it's, again, a basic piece, but you can accessorize it and put it with a lot of different things. It's going to be really versatile. You can wear this now in the winter, but since it's an open knit sweater, it's not quite as warm as a lot of other sweaters, so you can bring it into the spring also. And it has this really cool back with buttons going down. Oh my gosh, you guys, my new favorite store is Zara, and I recently went into there, and they were having a great sale, so I picked up two shirts. They were super cheap, especially compared to how much they originally were. And this first shirt that I got is just a gray knit top, and it had a Peter Pan collar, so I automatically gravitated toward it. And then it also has a scalloped bottom here, and I love scallops, so I think they're going to be really in for the springtime. So this is just a really nice basic top. Pretty much everything I got were just basics, but this was originally $30 and I got it for half off, it was $15, so great deal on that I thought. Then I got one more top from Zara and it is kind of the same color as the first top that I got from there, but except it is all lace. And I love all lace things, adding just a little camisole underneath it. And this was, I got this for $9.99, I think it was originally $30 also. I also went to The Loft and Ann Taylor, which you guys know, The Loft is one of my favorite stores. This first shot that I got from The Loft is going to be awesome for spring. It's navy blue with some magenta stripes to wear towards the bottom, and I think it's going to be gorgeous with a chunky necklace up here to kind of balance it out. It's three-quarter length, and it's kind of big. It's a really loose. I got one of the smallest sizes, and it's still pretty big on me. And this was also on sale when I was there the other day, so go check it out if you're interested in this shirt right here. I think they had a different color too. Really pretty. 
Then I also just got another basic just this black knit top to go with some skirts and shorts, kind of tuck it in, and it has some cute ruffles on the front. I only have one other black knit top and it was getting kind of a little rough, it was starting to ball up and things, so I needed a new one. And this was on sale, I think this was only like 6 or $7. Dollars. And then I got one shirt from Ann Taylor, which technically Ann Taylor and The Loft are different. The Loft, I think, is just more casual and Ann Taylor is like more business-like. But they were having a really good sale at both places. And I found this, it's kind of wrinkly, it's been sitting in the bag for a day. This just, it's just a t-shirt. And I don't have a lot of just, just plain t-shirts. And it's a really pretty pink color and that's one of my favorite colors and it has like a bow thing going down the front of it. I'm not really sure what to call that. Just some mesh. <laughs> kind of looks like a dress now that I think about it. Like it's up here cinched in at the waist and then it just flows down. Okay, that was a really weird comparison, but I just think this is really cute. My parents bought me two shirts for Valentine's Day and the first one I had picked out, I've been wanting it for a really long time. It is a Wild Fox Couture jumper and I absolutely adore this. It's so cute. It's just the white jumper with the pink glittery heart on it. And I found this at a store called Divine.com. They have a really large selection of Wild Fox Couture jumpers, especially ones with the glitter hearts on them or just hearts on them in general. They have so many different colors. I will have it linked down below in case you want to go check those out. Out, but I just love this so much. I'm gonna get so much use out of this because I just think it's so cute. I'd seriously wear this every day if I could. And then the other shirt my mom surprised me with. It is a Michael Kors shirt, but it came from Stymart. Stymart always has really great designer deals. They have Seven for All Mankind jeans. I got a pair of Seven for All Mankind jeans there for only $50 one time, which is just so sweet. So so good deal for a brand new pair of Sam from Mankind jeans. But this shirt right here was $25, originally $70. Who would pay $70 for a t-shirt? But it is pretty cute. It's just a white t-shirt and it has MK and little rhinestones on the front there. The last thing I have to show you guys is a jewelry item and it's these three bracelets. I have been loving just wearing like chunky bracelets on my arm and I love these beaded ones and these came from a store called GlambitionRush.com. It is my friend Kara's online jewelry store. She has a YouTube channel too. She makes beauty videos. I'll have their YouTube channel and her website linked down below so make sure you go check both those out. But I just saw these bracelets on her website and I had to get them. She hand makes all of her jewelry on there and it's just different color kind of pearl beads and it has a little gold accent bead on all of them but I just got one in pink one in gold and then one in purple that's pretty much it for my clothing haul thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys later bye